Joe Perry through to tomorrow's final here at the Bet Victor Welsh Open with a 6 5 win over Jack Klazowski. What a game. Yeah, I don't know what it must have looked like watching, but it was, you know, I love playing Jack Klazowski. I really enjoy the moment, I enjoy the challenge, I love watching him play, but I just couldn't enjoy it tonight because I just didn't feel right. I felt terrible. You know, my eyes were stinging, my head was hurting. When I was looking down my queue, I couldn't like focus on what I was supposed to focus on. And, and it's a shame, you know, I'm absolutely delighted to have won, but it just took the edge off. You know, I, I think I'm not one for doing cartwheels when I win a big match or anything like that, you know, but I think I would have really enjoyed that moment, clearing up to win, would have enjoyed it, but I just didn't because I just felt so flat and so just not well out there. Well, I was going to ask you about that. You, you're racing to 3 0 lead, then you, you, you were 5 3 up, you came back to 5 all. Uh, we were watching you, and you, in your chair, you looked tired, you, you looked like you were physically struggling with it. Are you okay? Yeah, no, I, it's, it's a thing I sort of battled with for years. You know, ever since I got diagnosed with my back issues, I, I just don't sleep. You know, I'd, I'd, I'd love to sleep seven hours. I, I have two or three hours I wake up. If I can get back to sleep, brilliant, but more times than not, I don't. So sometime during the day, I'll have another two or three hours to get my sort of sleep quota. And I've done that every day this week, and it's been nice, gone back in the afternoon, had a lovely little nap, I felt like my granddad. But uh, I didn't today, I don't know why. You know, I've done everything the same, shut the curtains, done everything the same, I just could not get to sleep. So I've come out there tonight and I just felt terrible. My eyes were stinging, everything just got worse. And, worse. and with the, the, maybe the pressure as well, you know, maybe that had something to do with it. You know, it's tough out there under them lights and it just all just gradually just closed in on me and it just got worse and worse. And to be honest, I, c I still can't believe I won, feeling like I did. But you did win. Crucially, you won. And it's put you into your first ranking event final in four years, incredibly. Um, that must feel so, so good. But you told me yesterday that, that your game is, is good now because you've been working harder. You must feel that some real satisfaction from that, that you've been practising more and now you're in your first ranking at final in four years. Yeah, I, I, people like myself, you know, I, I put myself in the same bracket as people like Mark Davis and Mark King, you know, people like that. We've been around a long, long time. We haven't won hardly anything, really, but we've all been at the top of the game for the best part of 30 years now, you know? So, so when we say we put the work in, I don't think we actually work to get better. I think our game is what it is. But you know, if, but it just goes to show you have to practice. You can't blag this game. You, you cannot get by on this game just turning up and playing. You can't do it anymore. The tour is so tough from top to bottom. And you know, it, it, I realized, I knew that, but for some reason I didn't do anything about it. And uh, I have done for sort of two or three months. So it's nice to get instant reward. You know, I thought it would take a bit longer, but it's nice to get like instant reward for the hard work. Well, it's certainly great to see now. The list of players that you've knocked out of this tournament so far, it's a bit of a who's who. David Gilbert, Sao Yupong, Mark Allen, Kyron Wilson, an in-form Ricky Walden, and now Jack Klazowski. Do you fancy adding Judd Trump to that list tomorrow? Well, I'd love to add Judd Trump to the list, but uh, yeah, uh, I think I've got to really work hard mentally now to just put today out of my head, you know, because it was a poor performance. Jack didn't play great. Yes, he come back at me like he does, but you know, I, I sort of just blagged my way through tonight. I didn't play great snooker, so I've got to just put that one away, put it to one side, and just focus on the other matches because the other matches, you know, I was up against it. Them great players you just mentioned also played quite well, and uh, I had to be at my best to beat them, and I was. So I need to sort of try and focus on that part of my game and, and bring that out tomorrow. Well, we're looking forward to a fantastic final. Well played today, Joe, and all the best for tomorrow. Cheers, Phil. Thank you.